Well, tonight we now know who will be helping the new Louisville mayor run the city once he takes office. Today, Mayor-elect Craig Greenberg announcing the top leaders that will help him run Louisville in his first elected position. Four familiar faces announced as deputy mayors today. They are former council member Barbara Sexton Smith, outgoing council member Nicole George, Metro Council President David James, who will be leaving that position, and attorney Dana Mayton, who worked in Congressman John Yarmuth's administration. Well-known local attorney David Kla Kaplan will serve as Chief of Staff and General Counsel, and Councilmember Keisha Dorsey will be Deputy Chief of Staff. WHS 11's Isaiah Kim Martinez covered the announcement today, and Isaiah, notably, no Chief of Police uh, safety on that list. No deputy mayor mm -hmm. overseeing the chief, the sure. police or LMPD. You're absolutely right, at least not at the moment. New, uh, of course, Mayor Lett Greenberg focusing primarily on his newly named interim police chief, Jackie Gwynn Billa Royale, who will report directly to him. As for the other positions, he took a page out of a previous mayor's book to assemble what he calls a diverse group of experience. As you can tell, this is an all star team. The last Louisville mayor to name four deputy mayors was Jerry Abramson. Someone current mayor elect Craig Greenberg says he consulted prior to this decision. What was the thought process behind breaking it up into four different specialties in this case? We have so many challenges facing our city. I thought that our administration could more effectively efficiently and better serve the community and address these challenges that we have through this structure. Greenberg prioritized adding current and former local lawmakers to his staff. Barbara Sexton Smith will oversee new offices focusing on the administration's priorities, but those weren't specified. Nicole George will be in charge of public health and Dana Mayton will handle operations and budget. And then David James, a former police detective, will supervise emergency services, including the Louisville Fire Department, Corrections, EMS, but notably not LMPD. Is there a part of you that's disappointed that police, at least some oversight, public safety is, is not necessarily a part of your role in the senior leadership team? No, absolutely not. We, we are a team and we're all going to work together and we're going to do everything we can do to make the number one responsibility of government is public safety. And so we're all working to make sure that that happens for everybody. Finally, we brought the conversation back to Greenberg's campaign promise to move Louisville in a new direction. What would you say to folks who maybe look at, at who's up here today and, and maybe question a new direction with familiar faces, what would you say to them? Just wait and see. Wait and see. Give us the opportunity to start to make meaningful change for our city, to start to continue the hard work that LMPD is working on right now to improve public safety. Why is that, that, uh, that was a good question. I mean, he's new to politics, so now he's surrounding himself, of course, with people who are veterans Absolutely. in all this. So what about the interim chief? You talked about her. Uh, what does she see? Where does she see herself moving forward in this role? Well, she says even after Greenberg names a permanent chief here, she will remain on his senior leadership team. Today, she gave credit to the community for helping them get violent crime numbers down at least some, we, we know some of those numbers that we talked 30 something percent or so. She says building that bond with neighborhoods, though, that priority will stay the same moving forward into next year. All right, Isaiah, thank you very much.